What's going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Battlefield 5. DICE has stated they will have a fix for soldier visibility very soon. As you can see here on the image on screen, what you see on the left is kind of how you see soldiers now when in a game. The image on the right will be how soldiers are seen when this update is released. It kind of has a little bit more lighting from the windows kind of shining correctly down on the floor and on the characters kind of how it would, I guess, glare off the characters more. Some people have said it's a little too bright, it looks like a spotlight, but in my opinion, any visibility fix to be able to see soldiers a little more clearly would be a plus in this game no matter what. Now DICE has stated that they have taken all this feedback from the community. The community has done a great job in letting them know what they would like fixed, so they're definitely giving props to the community for that. And this whole conversation is posted on Reddit from these images that I have here, and there's some other images in this conversation as well. I will link this whole kind of Reddit post down in the description below if you would like to read over it and look at it yourself. Now this game has had lighting issues since the beta in my opinion and a lot of people kind of credited that to oh there's no spotting anymore you can't see people as well but to me I, I, the spotting really has nothing to do with it. I know a lot of seen, heard, heard and seen people talk about that and spotting being gone is kind of a, a nice thing in my opinion. I kind of like that better that somebody can't spot you, just spam spot you from across the map and get you killed, uh, you know, just from sitting there and spamming the button. So I think the real issue here is something they haven't had in past games. Now, Battlefield 1 did have some lighting issues in my opinion, but all the other games you could see character models very well. Uh, the dark areas in this game just blend way too much with character silhouettes. Um... And what DICE is doing is trying to make characters more visible in dark areas and more visible in extremely bright areas, which is a good thing. They're looking at both kind of sides of this because, especially on the map I'm playing now, if you have a really white, bright camo on and you're laying out in the snow, it can be just as hard to see an enemy in a bright area as it can a dark area. DICE did state they want camos to still be effective. They still want you to be able to unlock camos and use them the way they should be used. But they did state that they are just too strong right now, and I do agree with that. It's hard to see characters as is, and if they put a dark or a light camo on whichever kind of map they're on, you know, for that particular game, it is still very difficult to see them with some of the uh, some of the camos they do have equipped. So hopefully, I, I I'm really hoping that this will fix this issue because, like I said, it's always been a turnoff for people since the beta. It's been a discussion since the beta that you cannot see the characters very well. And a lot of people kind of didn't like that, especially now that, like I said, from the start, there was not spotting. And like I said, I think that's a, a cool thing to me. I, I like the spotting mechanic has been taken out, but I still believe you need to be able to see character models at all times across the map. No, how, no, no matter how far they are away or close, you should still be able to have a distinction between them and the kind of visibility of their surroundings. You know, you shouldn't be able to kind of obscure your view because the surroundings are blending a character model too much. Leave me a comment, guys. Let me know what you think. Of course, if you liked it, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.